The Glock's trigger has a safety mechanism that holds the trigger firmly in place in case your finger shakes the trigger. The trigger can only be released to activate the firing pin if it is pulled deliberately. The magazines are staggered. Each round is loaded on top of the other. When the magazine is inserted in its final position, it is firmly seated. Next, the holster is pulled to the rear, which tightens the recoil spring. When the recoil spring is released, the slide pushes forward. At the same time, a round is stripped from the magazine and loaded. The barrel is tilted slightly upward during this process to ensure that it's properly cocked. When the trigger is pulled, the trigger bar goes in and pulls the firing pin back. The spring of the firing pin is compressed. As the trigger continues to move backward, the connector guides the trigger bar so that it swings downward, releasing the firing pin. The compressed spring immediately releases 